What's the beautiful people? This is Khurram from my guess well and hope you're having an amazing day. In today's video, we're gonna be testing out the Tesla Model Y Performance 2023 that I have. And we're gonna be doing the zero to 60 or you can call it zero to 100 kilometer per hour test. And also we're gonna be doing the heartbreaking emergency test to see if we are able to you know, stop the car and not gonna be wrecked. And I have a disclaimer guys, I wanted to share, see the neighborhood like this. Please do not try this in your neighborhood because there could be kids running around and there's going to be pedestrians, you know, there are biker boys or there are kids on the bicycle. So please don't try in this kind of neighborhood. You can see my neighborhood is pretty empty right now. If I wanted to, I could have done it over here, but you have to be responsible. If you're doing anything, please don't do anything stupid. So that was just the disclaimer. And now let's get into the testing and you will see a couple of clips. And then after those clips are ended, I'm going to talk about the results. So enjoy these. I took a couple of tries because there were, you know, some errors and I'm going to explain to you about the performance. So first enjoy those real time clips. All right, now let's talk about the results. So the run one was invalid because I did not have good reaction time. But run two, I was able to clock at 3.83 seconds for the zero to 60 and 4.02 in the kilometer per hour. If you guys want to know that timing was 4.02 seconds. And you can see the heartbreaking was pretty damn good on the Tesla Model Y performance with the brakes that it has. Tesla advertises at the 3.5 second speed but then I'll talk about, you know, after talking about the results, like how you can get there. So this is my final run solo. I was the only one in the car. So we have some weight reduction because my friend was not sitting next to me. You saw that clip. So I was able to even get better with the 0 to 60 at 3.76 seconds and 0 to 100 kilometer per hour at 3.87. And braking, again, every time it was consistent. You can see that's dead end. If the brakes give up on you, you are just getting wrecked into that. And I made sure that my pedals and the steering was in the performance sports mode for both, for the steering and handling. Now let's talk about how you can get even better than that. So if you charge your car up to the 90% and more, you'll be able to get the better performance out of your performance model Y. But if your car is charged at 70%, where my car was charged at around 75%, you are actually going to have a little lower speeds than what Tesla had, has advertised on their website, which is the 3.5 seconds. But getting closer to 3.7 and 3.8, that is pretty close. And you can see this car is pretty fast. So if you want to try it, make sure to choose a road where there's no so much traffic. Better take it to the track and then make sure that you reach there with more than 90% battery because that's where the most performance is and your car is going to be able to utilize that power for the performance. But if you're already at 75, 70% and lower, your car is going to be thinking that you're going to run out of battery or it's going to try to optimize the battery performance. So if you want to get the best out of your car, it has to be at least charged more than 90% where the battery is asking you to literally shake me off. So you have, if you want to shake that off, you have to make sure the battery is charged more than 90%. Make sure that you have good tires. I have the brand new Tesla Model Y 2023 and I was able to get the good performance out of it. So that's all I have from this video, guys. If you like it, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. And I'll see you guys maybe in another video when I have more than 90% charge when I get to the road like this because mostly I try to travel further away from my neighborhoods because I don't want to hit anyone and that would be really bad of you if you do it in the neighborhood. So I will try to take the charger with me, try to find an option like how I can charge it 
uh, at that location because there was no way that I was able to, you know, connect to a charger and charge my car and make it to more than 90%, you know, battery and try it out. But the speeds are impressive. Let me know in the comment section. I'll see you guys in another one. Until then, peace out.